Ooh. Ooh. Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy who done get it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. Uh -oh. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Lian of Tim Kulu, said African Geek. Welcome to my channel. About to dive right into Mortal Kombat. Man, I'm mad excited for this one. Man, we've been waiting. The trailer alone was fantastic, especially that moment where Sub Zero freezes Scorpion's blood and grabs it and stabs him with it. That was ripped out of the fucking video game. I'm so hyped. Anyway, what I know so far about this movie, we seeing this movie through the lens of uh, Cole, I think. Uh, and I think um, Warner Brothers likes to take reference from an animated movie, like to test the water. Let me say test the water with an animated movie. So there was an animated movie last year or the year before that dealt with the rivalry between Scorpion and Sub-Zero because of a family tragedy, which seems to be the case again here. So I'm mad excited. And that, because of that animation, because that animation really, you know, hit home with me. It was fucking fantastic. Anyway, I got my snacks ready. I'm mad excited. Um, everybody's bummed that Johnny Cage is not in this, but I feel like this is opening up the franchise. I feel like when Johnny Cage jumps into the franchise, like in the animation, he'll be playing catch up. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like Cole will be doing the same. But I feel like Cole also has some significance when it comes to the rivalry between Sub-Zero and Scorpion. It's just a hunch that everybody has. <laughs> anyway, let's not waste any more time and just dive right in. Mortal Kombat. Look at Scorpion and his family. Man, it would be so great to know Japanese for anime purposes. <laughs> and I want to go to Japan so bad. Ooh, that was a blood splatter right there. Chinese? So they're mixing a Chinese-Japanese rivalry in this? Like, why does he want to kill this dude so bad? They were friends? Yo, look at the VFX. It's your family, man. Look at that slow motion. Are you too late? Damn. Oh. Damn. They're not holding back. They give it a hard R. Get over here. Damn. Mm. The fight sequences are cool as fuck. He already knows who it is. That's not the end of the bloodline. There's a kid hidden in the basement. You're making a whole speech and the dude doesn't understand you? The hell? Would he have this car the whole movie? They tend to do that. He's going to win because of his power. Oh, he didn't. He just won a skill. I have to say, the score is so Mortal Kombat, though. Ooh. Don't forget the face. You will regret this. Lin Kuei. Is that the reasoning this whole time? You still alive? You hear your baby. Let's call it descendant of Scorpion. I mean, everybody gets that. I guess they were right. Died so close to his family. Ooh. Your journey's not over yet. Raiden. Is, his, is he gonna hide the kid? The VFX with the eyes need a little bit more work, but still cool. Ooh. Mortal Kombat. Let me guess. Cold is an orphan. 
Okay. He doesn't know nothing about his lineage. So he's a brash fighter. Damn. Jax. Jimmy Olsen. If he loses this fight with such an upper hand. Damn. Does have a shitty defense. Like I should know. Like I'm a fighter or something. <laughs> I feel like that moment is going to have more significance with him tapping out there. It's probably going to lead to him not tapping out somewhere else. Outworld. Woo! There is... Sub-Zero. Yo, so he trying to cheat? His design is so cool. He's definitely a descendant. Spiders who respect each other. There you go. Right, well, what do you want, Jax? He wants to talk about the mark on your head. Oh, the birthmark line makes so much more sense in the movie than it did in the trailer. So is this his daughter? Oh, oh is Sub-Zero gonna attack? What a cool way to make an entrance. With snow, nigga? Ooh. Damn. The music, yo. Ho, 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 ho. Yo, he don't give a shit about casualties. Oh, Jax is about to lose his arms. Yeah, he needs to know who the hell that was. Ooh, he caught up. So he just wants one fighter right now. Ooh. He's already made the inside of this place his playground. Ooh. Look at the calmness though. Yo, he ain't scared of Jax for shit. Yo. Ooh, you about to lose the arms. Ooh. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Damn. Fuck, you see it bleeding? Ooh. Damn. He's gonna push him over. Ooh. I guess Raiden's gonna save him. The bracelet's gonna be significant also. It's gonna remind him to never give up. Dude saved your life and gave you a car. Ooh. This place looks like hell. <laughs> Not even like hell is in the literal sense, but like it just looks like a shit time, a shit place, let me say that. They voices. Sonya Blade. Why is she so out of breath? They surf together. Dragon marking. Yo, it's this wall is so many Easter eggs. It's an who have they killed? There's more to Ooh, look who it is. Carefully bite. They tied him up. What? Can I the score that played when he announced himself was cool. Was Drug runner. Bad guy. How did she get her markings? Is it Melina? Ooh. It's the assassin. Ooh. It appeared so smoothly. It's got acid breath. Look at him using his brain. Ooh, -hoo -hoo, you about to die. It's a dope visual trick though. It's a problem for three of them? They are not ready for this tournament. Ooh. Did she just do a special move? Finish him. Kano wins. I guess Kano is like the comic relief. What are you doing? And an artist. You kidnapped me, you tied me up. She ain't gonna move. She moved? Oh, oh. What is he seeing? Is he seeing his great ancestor break out of hell? <laughs> A lot of desert scenes. <laughs> Ooh, are they about to go ham? All you gotta do is kill me. Ooh. Did she drop blood? 
You're so close. Look who it is. It's your boy. <laughs> oh, he's got his abilities. I'm not your enemy. You shot a fireball. <laughs> How'd you do that? It does, doesn't it? <laughs> There's much to learn. Dude is excited to get superpowers. Hey, David Copperfield. Eh? Looks like just a mountain, yo. Yes, he is. Start training now. Why ain't she? Why ain't he? Before, let me just, you know, well let it go. Us. It's Jax. Damn, his arms look fucked. It has been my charge. Champions of Earth. Liu Kang is so innocent. Entire human race. The accents are a choice, yo. Sorry, but I... Sub Zero found them. Fire versus ice. Ooh, back up. That was nice. That was nice. Team up. Damn, they all here. Did he put out a protection? <laughs> Everybody has like a unique score when they announce themselves. What's Sonya excited? She ain't got the mark. <laughs> She don't need. Right, bye -bye, Lonnie. She don't need the box. She ain't well, got a power. Still... Hey, Look how tiny your metal arms are. It, he is laying down. Some of the fight cardio is so bad though. Some of the VFX is so bad. But they got actors who can actually do the stuff. I give them props for that. <laughs> <laughs> if he gets hit by it again. Oh, <laughs> that's like the video game so much. Damn, his arms are tiny. The VFX is great at some points, man. Damn, they're really roasting the fuck out of him. Is he gonna get his powers because they roasting him? Yeah, he's definitely gonna get his powers because they roasted him. <laughs> I knew it. He just introducing new fighters just like that. Who's playing Cabal? Who's this? Oh! Oh! Are they gonna show? God damn. Ooh. Damn, what an entrance. Damn, they really sent him. He actually looks good. Is the tournament actually gonna happen in this movie? Oh, the VFX for the effects are phenomenal though. Ooh. Damn, Sonya getting that ass beat. Damn. He dropped the whole hand on her. Yo, this fight is so cool. I have a feeling she about to die. Just because you got wings don't mean you better than him. Coming over here with your wings and stuff. Ooh. Ooh. Damn, he handled her real quick. <laughs> that was nice. Cole's power is gonna kick in, I suppose. Is this like his move to tear you in half? A hero! Dude, save your family! Oh, there it is! Ooh! His power is some metal protector shit? Does he have like crazy defense? Ooh! Damn, he throwing four fist at you. Is he charging up? Ooh. Oh, that that looks so cool. Ooh. He can materialize different things. Oh, that's dope. Damn. Took an arm. Is he gonna run? Finish him. Oh. Aiki is so comfortable with murder and he hasn't killed yet. 
It's pain, is it? <laughs> They didn't kill them, what was the point? Is his power about to activate? Ooh, Transformer! Ho ho ho! He was actually stopped? Saved! Ooh, no! Level up! Level up! Save your cousin! Damn! Damn. Sonia. Damn. It's about to go down. So Sub Zero is just gonna wait for them to finish the other people, then he's gonna make his turn. <laughs> Damn. But it's dope way to make them go to arenas. He got new hands. Damn. Oh, he about to finish you. Ooh. Damn. <laughs> Is she gonna get her mark after beating his ass? Damn. Sonya Blade, win. Win, Sonya Blade. This is your scrapyard. Oh, you're gonna hit him with a gnome? Oh, shit. She got her mark. So this movie is building up to the Mortal Kombat tournament. <laughs> like, this is not the Mortal Kombat tournament. It's the movie that started it this century, in a sense. Damn. Burn, baby, burn. Ooh. Damn! She always pops up behind you. Why didn't you look there, dog? Ooh! Damn! This shit is so brutal, though. She got her abilities so quick. Damn! Is Sub Zero gonna attack the family? Look, I just want to get us out of here. Ooh! What did he do to his family? Damn! How did he know this was his gym? Oh yeah, he did track him down first. Damn, his daughter too? Where's Scorpion? Did he summon Scorpion? Ooh. You knew that was coming. Oh! Oh! Uh! 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 Damn. The showdown everybody wanted. Damn. Ooh, that was smooth. Ooh, it's about to go down. Ooh, it's just getting started. Ooh, yo, still an amazing scene. Yo. It's the same move again? Oh, he's he's prepared now. Ooh. That was a cool substitution jutsu. He's got two generations fighting him. Team up. Oh, he's scared, scared. Ooh. Damn. Yo, man, you lost this fight. Ooh. Damn. Ooh. The teamwork is impeccable. Revenge never tasted more sweeter. Damn. His face turning into a skull is so cool. They're all coming back, right? If there's a sequel or a series. Damn! Oh, it's not over yet. Are they about to have a showdown? I knew it wasn't over. They all coming back. Damn. Johnny Cage! Ooh. <laughs> He's recruiting Johnny? 
<laughs> what a tease. So let's talk about it. Let me hold the mic closer. Yo. It was phenomenal. In the sense of I was thoroughly entertained. Don't get me wrong. I was thoroughly entertained. Sure. The writing was cheesy. Some directions went like why the hell would Cole go back to his family when he left his family because they were in trouble because he had the mark when he still had the mark like why would you even give up or even if you gave up why would you go back to your family then be surprised when they get attacked that was just a weird moment for me but it was phenomenal the fatality scorpion's involvement was so little oh my god sub-zero was such a bad guy <laughs> I think we the next iterations, I hope it's a series so we can dive into each character individually, the individual past, uh, Sonya and Jax's uh, army days. Like, I really want to deep dive in each character and why they know each other. Like, Kanan and um, I'm going blank with that dude, that speedy dude <laughs> with the knives. Um, like, they relationship on top of that. Um everybody's relationships why outward was to take over earthland <laughs> it, it was hella entertaining i will say that it was hella entertaining uh cole lewis tran let's talk about that too he has movies he has a movie star look i'll give him that I can't blame him. Maybe it was the dialogue. Something didn't. Some scenes didn't hit as hard. Like even the obvious, obvious ADR that I saw. I heard. Let me put it that way. Jax. I actually surprisingly enjoyed Jax. I thought being a person who watches Super Supergirl to this day. Like I could not see him as Jimmy Olsen. But... Like saw him as Jax, Sonya Blade also her delivery. I think it was the overall writing of the dialogue, because it seems like a lot of these actors' deliveries were off. You know what I'm saying? Like, why would you say that right now? Why would we? this does not make sense in the context of the scene? Like, so many scenes like that happen, but it was phenomenal. I give it like a let's say seven out of ten because I really enjoyed it. Like, he gave me what I was hoping to get. Locations. Tournament-style fighting. Even the choreographs, some scenes were iffy. Some of the VFX were iffy, especially Outland when they saw the statue of the forearm dude. I was like, God damn, that looked like a fucking fan-made edit. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, it was, a good, it was a good time, though. I enjoyed it. For the most part, tell me what you guys think. Are you guys excited for more installments? Because they did tease Johnny Cage at the end, who really teased him. Like, do you think it's supposed to be a movie franchise, or do you think it, it should go on HBO Max? Or should it restart on HBO Max as a series, fresh start everything? Because, goddamn, making it one hour like 50 minutes really pigeonholed the story like you really left not caring for a lot of people like a lot of deaths if they did happen i wouldn't have cared <laughs> i'm just saying but it is what it is oh Kanan was oh my god he was like the comic relief he was so phenomenal he he got the best lines I feel like the writer just gave all him all the best lines make him more ch charismatic than everybody else Except Jax, yeah, Jax stands out and Scorpion and Sub Zero. But I need to know more about the relationship. They just showed us that these two are beefing for this and that. But I needed more context than that, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, 7 out of 10. Really, really enjoyed myself watching it. Uh, the hour 50 something minutes went by quick. No other complaints than that. Tell me what you guys think. Like if you like my reaction, I'll be doing more of these. Deuces.